All right, so this is just a slightly different way of getting your rear naked naked choke. Typically, we will always actually go over with the typical seatbelt, but the problem is though, my partner, if he knows, he will grab a hold of my forearm high, and so then basically he's still stopping the choking arm. So this is something else that I also uh, also do. I'll go over instead of me getting the, the normal seatbelt though, I'll turn my hands out and we'll take a gable gable grip. And whenever I get this gable gable grip, my top elbow I hide and I bug the hand right here. So now he can't really actually grab a hold of the top arm effectively. And as he grabs a hold, go ahead and actually grab. I can then twist in, grab a hold of his shoulder, come right back out, and then I hit my rear and get the big choke. So again, I want to take my knuckles right here, and I really want to bump it at like a person here, just to actually bug them. Because again, right here, he has all this space where he can actually grab a hold on, and now it's going to be hard for me to get the choke hand in. But if we go right here, and then we actually pull it back, and we're right here, most people, they will try to go for that, but then eventually they get annoyed, they, they start going more here. And as he wants to grab a hold, go ahead and actually grab a hold. Look, he's grabbing a hold of the wrong hand, and then pop this hand in and slice it. So I'm right here to look, I'm slicing it in this way. We're gonna, we're gonna go here to here. So as we're actually here, we're pulling back in, he actually attacks it, boom, he gets me what I, I want, and then you can actually finish it off with the classic rear naked choke, and then we're done.